YouTube. Okay, tonight we are going to do the husband tag. This one will be answering some questions. It's only a few questions, so it shouldn't be very long. Hey, I'm Nick. Um, okay, do you want me to ask you the questions? I'm sure. Yeah. You can read them for me. Where did where did we meet? We met, I always put that we met at church, um, at Liberty Baptist Church in Wichita Falls, um, but I can't really, I can't really say whether we met at Liberty Baptist Church or Burke Burnett High School first in Texas, so I can't tell you which one came first but it was it was one or the other right about the same time okay where was our first date uh, I don't remember your dad always talks about it I don't it's a restaurant in Wichita Falls isn't it that's not what I remember, but... I don't remember. We went to see The Illusionist. We did go see The Illusionist. We went to a movie. Mm -hmm. But I don't... Was that our first date? It's the first thing I can remember. Alright. I think that it was a restaurant, but what restaurant? I don't remember. Your dad always talks about it. It's like one of the the stories that he has from us dating. Mm. We'll have to ask him about it. Yeah. What was your first impression of me? <laughs> um, Feel free to answer honestly. That. That you were cute, but you were, I guess, a nerd. I, and you surrounded yourself with those few friends very closely. So, of course, around your friends, you acted different than whenever it was just us. But, yeah, your friends were... Uh, big influence on you and you were all a bunch of nerds. How long have we been together? Uh, we started dating in 2009 and... 2009? Yeah. That's when we got married. Oh. Right. We started dating in 2006, in October of 2006. And then we got married in June of 2009. Uh, we kind of dated off and on a couple times um, before. I decided that you could be wife material. What's my worst habit? I don't know. I'm not sure that I believe that. Every once in a while you'll forget to flush the toilet. But that's not. Is that my worst habit? I guess. I... Oh. Something that frustrates me is you like to leave my car doors unlocked. Like 
just sitting out in front of the house. Car doors unlocked for anyone to get in and take whatever they want out of my car, which happens a lot where we live. Just hasn't made it to our side of town that I know of. That. I'd rather her lock my doors and forget to flush the toilet. I'll take that over forgetting to flush the toilet every day. Next question. Best quality. That's your best quality? Yep. Uh... Should have read these over before we started. So I had time to think about it. I would say your best quality would probably be your stick to itness. It can also be a not so great quality, but once you make your mind up on something, you tend to stick to it. And there's a lot of people that give up nowadays. Yeah. I think I think that would be near the top I I'd have to think about that for a while what is your favorite kind of food yeah what's my favorite kind of food I know you like like hibachi grill. I know that's up there. I know you like steak. You like a good steak. <laughs> As of recent, you like ramen noodles. Well, that's not real recent. You've liked ramen noodles since we've been married. Macaroni and cheese. If you could pick one thing. Not necessarily something that I eat often, but something that I really enjoy eating. Ice cream. Final answer. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't know how accurate that is, but... I know you're a ice cream aholic. Uh, no. What? Well, do we have a song? What's your song? Do we have a song? No. Mm. Unfortunately, we if you really could pick a song. A song To describe me, what would it be? Or to describe a relationship? Mm. I was going to say tainted love, just to be funny. Um, I think... I, I know it, it's like a real cliché couple's song, but uh, God Gave Me You I don't, there's a few different people that sing it, I don't know who the original artist was, but that's a good one, God Gave Me You Okay. I think of you 
definitely think of you when it comes on the radio. Would you care to explain your reasoning behind both of those hmm. answers? Well, I mean, the lyrics say, God gave me you for the ups and downs, and we've shared some great moments together, some very joyful moments together, and we've also shared some very it's like the first video I've actually been a part of and I'm crying Sorry. we've also shared some very hard times together I think most couples have and I mean whether it was a good thing at the time or a bad thing at the time you, you were there you know, um, and honestly, I don't, I mean, there's just nobody else that I could see myself going through those trials with, or even those great times with the, the highs or the lows. I mean, there's, there's other people out there, but I wouldn't want to go through the highs or the lows with anybody else. Mm -hmm. I don't know how. <laughs> We've been through so many highs and so many lows. We, we kind of have us figured out, like how to, how to work through those. Each, each challenge is different, but. Uh, I mean, as much as it might suck at the time, I think we work through things pretty reasonably. I mean, we're both alive still, so <laughs> that's a plus. We haven't killed each other yet. So, yeah. Do you have any other comments you want to make? Cooper just using the bathroom. <laughs> Mm, I don't think so. I, yeah. So, other YouTube families, their houses are beautiful. Um, we live in our house. Ours is not beautiful. I, it, it's, it's beautiful. <laughs> we have a very nice house, but we live in our house. I work a full-time job. And she takes care of two rugrats all day and works a part time, would that be fair to say? Or a self employed It's self employed, yeah. but I would consider it. She works she works a job. She works a part time job. And we have this. Our doggy. So there's your warning. Our house is not always clean. It's not always perfect because we live in it. I'm I'm not too apologetic for it either. If you don't like it, don't watch the videos. <laughs> if you don't like it, don't come over. That's just how it is. And I think, I think, I think most people will understand. Yeah. Anything else? I'm tired. Well, there you have it, folks. That's the husband tag. Um, hope you'll have a good evening.